Welcome back. It's time for us to speak to Patrick. Let's see about having a class warfare. Glad you made it, Schwarzer. I do apologize that we had to trouble you with this. But in spite of my attempts to dissuade him, Master Patrick insisted that he just had to fight you today. D don't voice this all on me. You were the one who wanted our fight to happen before you went home next week. You would do well not to portray me as some sort of selfish child who inconveniences others for no reason. <laughs> well, my schedule's free either way. So you want to settle which of our classes is stronger, right? Precisely. We may have faced off during the war, but it could hardly be claimed that we were fighting on equal footing. Which means that we've yet to properly determine which of us is superior. We nobles or you class 7? It's true. I've been trying to figure that out for a while. Quite a while, too. Bringing it up right before the end of the year like this is pretty bold of you. Hm. I just don't like leaving such matters unresolved, that's all. With so many of your classmates set to leave us so soon, this is our final opportunity to settle this. So let us do so. After a year of back and forth, we'll prove once and for all which of us deserves to come out on top. Sure, I'm for it. You might even be able to give us a real challenge after all you've been through. Hm. Then we're on. In that case, Masterine, would you mind choosing a partner to fight by your side? A classmate, of course. The two of you represent Class 7, while I, Master Patrick, and I will represent Class 1. Yeah, I wouldn't want any non-students representing my class. A two-on-two -two match sounds just fine to me. I mean, Patrick has been training for this day for a long time. Not the kind of guy who would do this on a whim. You can't underestimate Celestin either. I should defeat him once, but... Definitely wasn't easy. As soon as your partner arrives, we will begin. Was there anyone you had in mind? Let the battle begin. Yeah, I know just who to call. Whoever takes this battle is the champion, bar none. No complaints, no regrets, and no rematches. You okay with that? Hmm. I wouldn't have it any other way. Then if you would, please call for your partner, Masterine. Okay, so I'm thinking... Emma. Reen used his Arcus to call his chosen classmate. Right, make sure we're still sorted with quartz and stuff. Seems good from what we had ages ago, equipment-wise. Let's get... Uh, ooh, let's get Annoy back on, finally. Trapping close. Yes! <laughs> Reen already informed me of what we'll be doing. I'll be sure to give this fight my very best. <laughs> You're both worthy opponents. You'll hold nothing back, Celestin. Indeed, it's high time for us to demonstrate our new skills. have gotten stronger than the last time we fought them. A lot stronger. Until we're here representing our classmates, there's no way we'll lose. Let's do this. Of course. Watch out! This is a tough one! <laughs> My turn! Go straight to overdrive. Here goes! Overdrive! Okay. Flame dragon. Burn to ash. Fall. Now's our chance. I'll back you up. Here I go. Do, 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 do. Hmm. Let's do it. Now.
So pretty. Whoa. That got them, didn't it? Shit. Way to show us how it's done. <laughs> You're too kind. Too kind? What? You destroyed them. Bloody hell. I should have known we wouldn't be able to defeat you after all. Both fought splendidly. Same goes for you two. There's no telling which way it would have gone. What? That's for sure. That's one should be proud. Especially with the way you two use Arcus links together. Very impressive. I agree. Proud to be from the same academy as someone with skills like yours, Patrick. You really can't help yourself, can you? No, he can't. Still, you fought well and defeated us fair and square. I suppose I can finally accept Class 7 as Class 1's ultimate rivals. Patrick? <laughs> what are you waiting for? Right. This isn't over yet. Patrick, I can't believe you tried to settle things between Class 1 and Class 7 without us. Hello, Phyllis. I did get our class's permission to do so, did I not? I, I thought this was only going to be a rematch of the practical exam last June. Besides, we've yet to properly determine which of us is superior, we nobles or you class 7. That's what you said, right? If you're deciding where the nobles stand, you need to fight on behalf of all of the upper class. Not just year one, class one. Isn't that kind of splitting hairs? Um, I feel a little lost all of a sudden. What are you trying to suggest? Allow me to explain. Vincent? I, the perpetually elegant Vincent Florald, am here on behalf of the upper class second years of this academy. And I have brought my dear and dedicated sister with me to battle, my good fellows. As the Florald family's maid, I will also be taking part in this battle. I do hope you will accept our challenge. All of the upper class students have already given us their approval to fight on their behalf. Let us battle for the honor of being known as the strongest in the academy. S strongest in the academy? This is escalating awfully fast. But this is our last chance to all come together like this. Our last chance to make memories to treasure for- I, I mean, our last chance to close the book on our feud. Lady Ferris, at this point, the cat isn't just out of the bag, it has a little box and a scratching post. Okay, so just to recap, you want to settle things too, is that right? Not given this might be our last chance. Don't see any harm in giving her what she wants. True enough. Alright, we accept your challenge. I would love to launch into battle right away, but... It would hardly be fair if we fought you three on two. Please call enough of your classmates to balance our teams a little. Good call, let me think. I think at least at this point. Rin used his Arcus to call his chosen classmate. Okay, I think we're good in terms of ornaments and stuff, aren't we? Nubius. Equipment-wise, um, let's get your trapping clothes. Lovely, lovely. Yeah, I, think, I think we're probably good, aren't we? Yeah, you know, Reen, some people would use their final free day to relax. Still, if the class is depending on us, I'll make sure we win. Especially since we're fighting Ferris. There's no way I'll let her us lose to her. <laughs> Thank you ever so much for willingly accepting our challenge. Now prepare to fall against the results of two solid months of brutal training. Well said, Sister Sublime. I, for one, shall demonstrate my refined spear techniques more beautiful and dangerous than an angered swan. For my part, I will show you just a glimpse of- uh, Hoorah! Uh, hoo, or well, whatever. Yeah, enough time to read it. But, well, points for enthusiasm. They're clearly tougher than when we last fought them. Sarifa doesn't seem to want to hold back against us in the slightest. Then we shall serve as the referees. Very well. Let the best competitors win. Both teams are ready. Let the battle begin. This one looks dangerous. Be careful. My turn. Yep. All right. That seemed very strange to me. Uh, Here I go. 
Now let's bring it out straight away again. Just the fact she's got guns, it's like, whoa. Yeah. No, you don't! There! Oh, please! But of course. Right. Mm. Let's get these throwing out. Jump. Let me help. Thank Thanks. you. Well, it's not much, but thank you. Let's I should move. make sure I heal up there. Huh. That's it. It's like, mm. Like Lloyd. At least it does end up dodging while she's casting. And I just got interrupted, which is annoying. Sorry, everyone. Oh dear. It's my turn. Alright. Didn't expect that. So Zodiac Rain. Great star. And sense my voice. And heed my call. I was waiting for the crafts and then she interrupted me, so it's like, ah. That's the only problem there. Be careful, because I could easily lose here at this point. Great white reside in my bow. Radiant Sight. Uh, I need to get round to Elisa, and it's like chances are very, very slim that's going to happen. No, uh oh. Yep. No. Damn it. Retry. Careful. This one looks strong. Right. So. It's like I want to get that crap. It's like again. It's like it's I want turn. to get. So let's do that. Let's let's just see if I can just knock them back a bit. It's my turn. Because mm. it's like again, just, I just want to get these crafts out, no and then problem. I know I win. Arcus, activate. It's like just just get through these things. Stop interrupting me. Thanks. Here and I let go. me cast them. Ha! Here I go. Oh, I didn't realize that would have done it. Fair enough. Fair enough. There. There. I should have expected as much from people whom Lady Ferris regarded so highly. You're one strong maid, Sarifa. Can't believe that after all I trained, I still was enough. Ferris. <laughs> Still, I accept my defeat. You fought exceptionally. It's not like you didn't give us a good run for our mirror, though. Took all we had to defeat you. I'm going to treasure the memory of this battle forever. That's for sure. <laughs> oh, you. Still, now that you've defeated us, you have your confirmation that the members of Class 7 are the strongest in the Academy. <laughs> yeah, still not sure how to respond to that. But thanks, I guess. Oh, did someone say strongest in the academy? Who? That, that sounds like... Oh, the music. P Principal Van Dyke! Pleased you're here, sir. I do believe we secure permission to use the field. <laughs> oh, you're not in trouble, the arms. I just was curious as to how the battle was going, so I wanted a closer look. And I'm certainly glad I did. Everyone has fought remarkably well so far. It's been quite the spectacle. But I've been so caught up in all the excitement and enthusiasm that I can no longer stand idly by. Grasp me, he's being ridiculous. But he's never been one to change his mind once it's made up no matter how much I try. 
Please tell me this doesn't mean what I think it means. It does indeed. The two of us would like to join in the fun. Besides, you didn't think I'd let you get away recording yourself as the strongest in the academy without defeating us, did you? Ordinarily, I wouldn't participate in this nonsense, but someone has to make sure he doesn't overexert himself. What have I started? I would be happy to take on everyone here at once, but as Class 7 won the previous battles, perhaps they should be off first. I can't help but feel like a bully taking on helpless students like this. I'm afraid I don't have much of a choice. You really do seem strong. Still, we can't just roll over and give up without a fight. Sure, individually, I've one of them could crush any of us to dust, but if we work together, I think we stand a chance. Let's see how far our strength can take us. We might never get another chance to test ourselves like this. Yeah, you're right. When you put it like that, I agree. <laughs> There's our class seven. Though it wouldn't be fair if only three of you took us on. We should call another one of your classmates. No fun for any of us in an easy win, after all. Okay, now I'm really scared. And who should I even call? Um. Hmm. Laura. Green used his Arcus to call his chosen classmate. Alright, you still have what I hope you have. Yes. And change your clothes. I don't think I've ever seen foes so imposing. The most satisfying challenges to overcome are the ones that seem hopeless. Guys, this might be our hardest challenge to date. It's time to give them all we've got. Let's see how far our combined strength will take us in the mightiest people in this academy. We can do this! Right! <laughs> now that's the spirit. Then let the fun begin! Here we go! Careful! This one looks strong! It's like, uh, let's get Radiant Life. Witness the fruits of my training! For obvious reasons. Not bad, not bad. Let's actually get the other things out of the way. Great. I'm actually a view rings. Should have probably waited for the crit coming our way. My blade will cleave ignorance and light the way. So close. No! Don't do that. I put so much effort into getting your health down. Oh, God damn it. No! Ow. Unforgivable. Need more of that, Let really. Me help. Thanks. My turn. Do spirit unification, but I also want ah. so many things I want to come out right now. Ha! Let's move. Do I have any Zerams? I have one. Ha! It's like screw it. Good. Right, hopefully I can get that out. Probably gonna die. Oh, sorry, oh my sorry, god. Here I go. Like throw it out again. Probably not gonna help me. Yeah, because like mm, the first aid's gonna be an issue. Here I go. Because like, I thought I could get that done quickly, but it's like no. Should have gone about it a bit slower. I feel. I'm sorry, everyone. Retry. A worthy adversary. 
Here we go. It's very much I was trying to get Laura's out as quickly as possible. It's like, all right, let's go. Let's go this way. Huh. You have my face. Like now we'll go, Laura's. <laughs> we should have saved the zero arts for maybe Witness something else. <laughs> Again, that first aid is just so annoying. It's my turn. Should link people back up. Let's link you two up. Do this. Arcus, activate. Yeah. Oh, I God damn. All right, try again. Try again. Try again. Watch out. This is a tough one. It's like, eh. eh. Witness I'll have trick. that crit, thank you. All right, so. Let's move. All right, so I'm thinking. You have my face. I can do this. So I'm just, I, I'm just—I'm trying to find like a training. like the quickest way to do it, sort of thing. <sighs> yes, that's what I wanted. Right. Arcus, activate. It's my turn. Arcus, activate. <sighs> I just wanted her out of the way. <sighs> yeah, you keep my doing turn. that, mate. You keep doing that. Now's our chance. An opening. <sighs> This should. Yep. Now. It should get you a big hit and get you. There we go. That's what I wanted. Not the best display. Be I was just now. playing around. Plus, I don't remember everything exactly because I've been to Azure for so long. Great. Not exactly like it's that different. It's just my group setups and stuff. Thank goodness. Hmm. Not. Not. My, I have to admit, I'm impressed. Never would have expected you to be able to overpower us like that. Only really grown for your experiences during the war. <laughs> we only won because we were together. None of us are even half of either of you on our own. I meant to enjoy your onslaught, but it pushed me to the very end of my limits. As tough as it was, we managed to topple the strongest people in the academy. <laughs> you most certainly did. I have nothing but praise for the way you fought today. But most of Class 7 will be leaving this academy and starting new lives elsewhere. The things you've learned and the skills you've developed here are now part of you. And will remain so wherever you go. That you were able to defeat us today is fine proof of how you've grown. May you continue to nurture your skills elsewhere. We will. Thank you, sir. I'm sure that the things I learned here will be priceless to me as I continue my life beyond the academy. Sorry to make you waste some of the Little time you have left on fighting two old fogies like us. So please let me tend to your wounds at least. Not only was everyone's HP and EP fully restored, they also recovered 200 CP. Wow. Your skill with healing arts is truly exceptional. I appreciate you healing us as well. Yeah, well, thanks, Fair Instructor. Just remember to take it easy for a while. Arts are no substitute for proper medical care, after all. Well, Principal, I think it's time we let these students be. As do I. <laughs> Farewell for now. I very much hope we'll have the chance for a rematch someday. I can spoil the ending of our rematch for you right now. We lose. <laughs> Still, at least you beat them once. That's a greater achievement than most will ever be able to claim. And I'm going to give you my highest commendation for your excellent performance. To be frank, very frank, I would love the chance to fight all of you again one day too. <laughs> that would be great. You fought particularly wonderfully, Elisa. I hope that we will get another chance to compete with one another again. We will. I promise. Like, that's one of the reasons you have to bring Elisa. Hm. Can't believe you are actually able to overcome those two. You and your classmates truly are something else. Schwarzer, I would like you to accept this. 
Albion Guard. Great, right, but uh, what is it? It's been passed down through the Arms family for generations. I'd like you to have it in honor of your victory. Hope you can appreciate it. Thanks, Patrick. I really will. <laughs> I have something for you as well. Thank you. <laughs> but don't let your victories today make you complacent. Not unless you want to be thoroughly trounced when we next fight, at least. Wouldn't dream of it. I just want to say, while we might have had our disagreements over the past year, I think we've both grown as a result. We grew in a way we couldn't have if we hadn't been rivals. And we couldn't wish for better rivals than Class 1. Don't you worry, Ferris. I'll be sure to keep training for the next time we face off. <laughs> I haven't stopped improving myself since I was a child. That certainly isn't going to change now. We do appreciate the warning, though. Ugh, your class unrestrained honesty continues to be an assault on our senses. Still, I suppose that's part of what makes you who you are, and the rivals who have earned so much of our respect. There's the thumbnail. Thus, the long-term conflict between classes 1 and 7 reached its conclusion. Everyone involved accepted one another as worthy rivals and friends, praising each other's skills. Eventually, with some reluctance, they all left and went their separate ways. Yeah, 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 yeah. Alright, so... question is, where did those two go? So I want to speak to them. We lost you and your classmates fair and square, I won't contest that. However, my competition with Lisa is entirely separate and continues to rage on. It's a rivalry we shall settle not through combat, but through lacrosse. <laughs> Lisa's lucky to have such a good friend in Ferris. Oh, this going to be the same. But it is like, where is Patrick? The time has come. What was that just now? It's just my imagination? No, it couldn't have been. You have also sensed the disturbance I presume. Huh? Is that you, Valimar? Wait, did I just feel the same thing you felt yesterday? Indeed. There was movement within the earth phase, but not solely that. I now sense something else. It sounds like I've got an investigation to do came from that direction, and that can only mean... The old shoe house. Correct. The structure beneath which I once lay dormant, known to you and your friends as the old schoolhouse. Name of the game, everyone. And it's dark. Anyway, ooh, music change. Still want to find Patrick. Because it's like, he'll, he'll no doubt have updated and changed. The music goes back to that. It's like, oh, no, it's fine here. Yeah. There you are. I accept defeat for this year, at least. But next year, we will fight again, and you won't be so lucky. <laughs> sure, bring it on. But what a terrible shame that you were defeated, Mr. Patrick. This means that your plans to win over Lady Elise by boasting of your victory are effectively foiled. That was just a joke, Celestin. Surely you understand that, right? Oh, what's this interesting development? Please do fill me in on the little plans of yours, Patrick. I just love to hear about them. Why must you get like this in any in any matter concerning your sister? <laughs> nice to see your next academic year will have something to look forward to. I shall be returning to the Arms household for a short while. Allow me to leave Master Patrick in your care during my absence. But please don't misunderstand. I intend to get your permission before initiating any contact with her, I, I assure you. Never dream of going behind your back. Sure, I might have sent her a couple of letters, but those are all harmless fun. Patrick, you and I are going to have a nice long talk later that you will not enjoy. Oh dear, oh dear. I wonder if, um, say other people have updated. No, that's completely different. Okay, very well. Right, so what I'm thinking is we end this part here, and the next part... Oh, actually. We should actually see about speaking to Toe, because that's actually a quest that's finished, isn't it? So, we should hand that in first. That should be the final one to hand in. We made some headway. There we go. Wow! That must
must have been tough. I suppose. Like that's that. Right, so we shall end this part here then. And in the next part, we'll head off to the old shoe house. Ta-ta for now. <laughs>